Hi, welcome back to my channel, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Cruising with Cody. Guys, in today's episode, I'm going to talk about what should be your height and what should be your weight to work on a cruise ship. I repeat, height and weight. So, guys, please watch this video till the end. And before that, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and click that subscribe button and don't forget to click that bell icon also because whenever I'm going to post a video, you will get a notification if you click that bell icon. So guys, without wasting time, let's start this video. It's awesome. Well guys, let's begin with the height criteria. Lot of people ask me, sir, can you please tell me my height is little short? Can I work on a cruise ship? And the good news is this, there is no height criteria to work on a cruise ship. That is the best part. But guys, there is one criteria where you might get rejected because of your height, which is you should not be medically challenged. You have seen the midget people, the small people. Yes, they are medically challenged. They might not get selected on a cruise ship. And there is a reason behind it because we work on a cruise ship which travels on water. An emergency can happen anytime and you should be fully fit to carry the passengers with you and guide them. And if you are not able to do that, then you are not supposed to get selected on a cruise ship. That is the only reason your height should be not medically challenged. That's it. Profession like air hostess, army, policemen, they require certain kind of a height. But working on a cruise ship, you don't require a particular height. You can work in any department. I have seen the tallest guy and I have even seen the shortest guy. So you can work on a cruise ship. There is no height criteria, whether regardless in a kitchen or in, even in a passenger area. You just need to be presentable. That's it. Nobody will pinpoint you on a height. Well, guys, now I'll talk about the weight factor and which is a very important thing. Please pay attention what I'm saying. So the weight matters. Let's take an example. My height is 5'4", okay? And my weight is around between 55 to 60. Yes, I can work on a cruise ship because according to my height, my weight is proper. But just imagine my height is 5'4", and if my weight is 100 kgs, I am overweight. That time I will fail the medicals. <laughs> so guys, it really matters. You should not be overweight or underweight also. Little overweight is fine. For example, my weight should be 60 kgs and I'm 70. That's absolutely fine. But you should not go overweight. So weight really matters. You can go on Google, put your height and according to your height, what should be your weight? Please, if you are too overweight, please reduce your weight and apply for a cruise. Because if you are overweight, you might fail your medicals. So the weight matters. Rest all is absolutely fine. So guys, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Please share my videos. So people will know how's the life on a cruise ship and what are the criteria to get selected or to work on a cruise ship. So that is what all I want you to do is subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon. So I will come up with another beautiful video only for you people. So bye from Cruising with Holy.